Hello, and today we're continuing our rosacea series by talking about procedures, procedures mainly being PDL and IPL. PDL is a laser, it stands for pulse dyed light, and it only treats red. It has one job. IPL, conversely, that is a light. It is an intense pulsed light, and it treats both red and brown, so a little more versatile, but you'd need more sessions to treat all of the redness. Now let's talk PDL specifically. Like we said, PDL only targets red, so it's drawn to the vessels, it collapses the vessels, then the vessels kind of disintegrate and you can't see them anymore from the skin. The actual procedure itself is pretty quick. You may or may not have numbing cream and the actual laser itself, it feels like a rubber band snapping. Depending on the settings, you may bruise in response to the laser, and this is a very accurate representation of what bruising is like after a PDL, and it does resolve over the next week or so. You may have heard of V-Beam, so what is that? V-Beam is basically the brand name of PDL. It's manufactured by Candela. So PDL is generic, like these generic tissues, whereas V-Beam is Kleenex. Now let's move on to IPL or intense pulsed light. And what exactly is it? Well, it is just that it is a light, not a laser. And what's the difference? So a light has multiple wavelengths. It's less precise. It's more superficial in the skin and you can treat multiple things. You can treat both red vessels and brown age spots, but it does require more sessions to get the same effect. By contrast, a laser, it has one wavelength, it has one job, it penetrates deeper into the skin, and you need fewer sessions to get the same job done. So with IPL, you can treat both red vessels and brown sunspots. Before the procedure, they will apply a cooling gel and give you eye protection. The procedure itself feels like a snapping rubber band. It feels pretty similar to PDL. You'll be a little red after the treatment, and IPL is not safe for darker skin tone. 